Describe each transformation and derive the equation of the transformed graph. Draw the original and transformed graphs. In part A, the graph of f of x equals x squared minus 1 is transformed by the equation y equals 2 f of x. The transformation y equals 2 f of x is a vertical stretch by a factor of 2 about the x-axis. We can obtain the transformed function by plugging f of x into the transformation equation. Bring down the transformation equation. Replace f of x in the transformation equation with x squared minus 1. Simplify by multiplying 2 through the brackets. If we stretch the graph vertically by a factor of 2, we get the graph of y equals 2x squared minus 2. In part b, the graph of f of x equals x squared plus 1 is transformed by the equation y equals f of 2x. The transformation y equals f of 2x is a horizontal stretch by a factor of 1 half about the y-axis. We can obtain the transformed function by finding f of 2x. Start with the function of the original graph. Replace the function input with 2x, then plug this in on the right side. Two x in brackets squared is four x squared. The equation of the transformed graph is f of two x equals four x squared plus one. If we horizontally stretch the original graph by a factor of one half, we get the graph of y equals four x squared plus one. In part c, the graph of f of x equals x squared minus 2 is transformed by the equation y equals negative f of x. The transformation y equals negative f of x is a reflection about the x-axis. We can obtain the transformed function by plugging f of x into the transformation equation. Bring down the transformation equation. Replace f of x in the transformation equation with x squared minus 2. Multiply negative 1 through the brackets to get negative x squared plus 2. If we reflect the original graph about the x-axis, we get the graph of y equals negative x squared plus 2. In part d, the graph of f of x equals x minus 6 squared is transformed by the equation y equals f of negative x. The transformation y equals f of negative x is a reflection about the y-axis. We can obtain the transformed function by finding f of negative x. Start with the function of the original graph. Replace the function input with negative x and plug this in on the right side. If we reflect the graph about the y-axis, we get the graph of y equals negative x minus 6 squared.